Okay, you're on stage now, Earthy. Goddess Earthy's bedtime story for the cosmic kids to bring to life the fable of the Delphic Oracle to stimulate lonely teenage prophecy clits about the prophecy pit among the nether lips on the southern slopes along the ridges of snow-capped Mount Parnassus, mm -hmm. among the hot, frustrated Fiedras rocks. Good thing it was by the cooling stream, the Castolian Spring. Your GPSing is like out of this world. Ah, flowing thunderously through the Papidia Ravine, through pine, Cypress, olive groves, to the Pleistos Gorge. When a rocky chasm did issue its forth an enigmatic vapor, <laughs> what was in the vapor? Natural nitrous oxide made by the earth, a little freaky thing. You know, nitrous oxide, big tank of that, Grateful Dead concert, big tank sticking out the back of a pickup truck, have a balloon of that, just... <laughs> and enjoy being God for 13 seconds. See, that was her trick, right? And the earth just... Kissed it up for free, but nobody knew about it for millions of years, you know, until this hissing vapor from an unknown chasm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Enigmatic vapor. It's nitrous oxide. Okay. Um, a strange, sexy, <laughs> hissing. <laughs> Pneumatic rush of cold, yet at the same time steaming. That's like nitrous. Uh, air rising from a crevice in the earth, like you. You are the earth, so you had a crevice. She's got a crevice. Uh, overwhelming, a curious... Mycenaean goat, you know, a raggedy goat herder with a bunch of goats, and this one goat <laughs> into the nitrous, and what happened? It caused the Mycenaean goat to <laughs> flip out completely and bleat like a crossed, fucked sheep. <laughs> Bleh. <laughs>